13th, our first official residential job. I also have to get a contract for Will because he's the first employee that I have ever employed. Well, in this company at least. So right here, I have an independent contractor agreement between myself and William. So I'm gonna go up and sign it here. Once Will signs this, I'm gonna give him a copy and I'm gonna have a copy. And sign the other one. Let's get it. Another day, <laughs> another parking ticket. We're going to our first ever residential job. This is the first official stop. Let's go! Woo! Let's go, baby. We get a call saying that the elevators are not working. Now we got to figure out what's going to go on. Are we going to do the job? It could be one of those things where we've paid for the truck. I paid for all the equipment, all the boxes. Do I want to rent a car again and do the job? Obviously, like we got to get the job done. But it could be another thing where it's now that we figured out that the elevators aren't working, can we potentially take it down the stairs? If that's the case, then we might have to tack on a couple of hundred bucks to the job. It has become more and more and more difficult. All right, me and Will are in the truck. We're just going to wait 15 more minutes to see if we're going to do the job today. So without further ado, I have to sign my end. Here we go. Oh, you ready for me to sign my life away? Yeah. He's got two lives signed away. Welcome to the team, bro. Woo! Let's go. Woo! Basically what happened was we were supposed to do a job today. The real estate agent called us and said the elevators are not working, but then a miracle happened. One of the elevators is working. We might have to just bring some of the furniture down like one or two levels, which is fine with me. We got a bed to take care of. We got a lock. We just want to get the job done. She said, oh, can you guys do this next week? We don't want to do it next week. We want to get it done now. got a dolly it's about 67 dollars we're spending a lot of money but like today's job we're gonna kill it so fun fact i still live in that building wow so look at all this stuff we're almost three hours in a lot of work that's a lot of fun <laughs> let's go bro So we just finished up now. <laughs> oh, that's fucking so uh, stressful. Uh, now we drop the truck off and we get that payday, baby. Who said being your boss is tough? <laughs> Holy. Wow. Yeah. Oh, wow. Guys. <laughs> this is wild. We're almost into the month of March. We've done about two or three jobs. We got another job today. One of the clients that we had worked with before, she called me and she asked if we could get some stuff done on one of the properties that she's working on. She wanted it done today or tomorrow. We have a snowstorm tomorrow, so I'm not gonna be able to do it tomorrow. So right now I'm rushing all the way from my hometown to Toronto, about a half an hour, 45 minute drive. I'm almost there, I'm gonna rush inside, get my uniform. I have to find a U-Haul truck right away. A little stressful, but we have essentially two hours to get the the truck go to the person's house the junkyard closes at 11 30 so we got a tight window and i only get the truck for like three four hours so i gotta basically hold i'll check in when i'm in the u-haul with you guys peace So right now we're on our way to the dump. Everything's really, really slow. We're basically in a winter storm. Apparently it's gonna be the last winter storm of the season, but you never know. We went to the property, we picked up all the stuff, we threw it in the back of the trunk. Now we're just on our way to the dump. We'll see you when we're there. Me and Will just got to the dump right now. We're just stopped right at the scale. So as soon as we get weighed up, we're gonna take all the garbage out of there and Guess let's go. go. Throw it out of there. Originally we went to the Ingram transfer station, they were closed, but thank God GFL was open. Otherwise we would have had a truck filled with junk. So right now we're just clearing out the truck. We got an $80 minimum. So this job might be a loss. At the end of the day, we're learning as we're going. We're gonna have some fun. All right. Let's go, baby. What'd you think about today, Will? Going to that second transportation center. Oh my goodness. I didn't think we were gonna make it. So we just got to the U-Haul place, me and Will. We're just gonna wait for an Uber, get picked up and then hop on out of here. But we got a solid day's work. I'm gonna send her the bill. She'll email transfer me. Let's go. Let's go.